Turning to the pandemic, a colorful celebration overnight as the former epicenter of the coronavirus takes a big step towards returning to normal. Overnight, New York State celebrating a COVID milestone. Fireworks lighting up the night sky in cities across the state. And 13 landmarks from Niagara Falls to the Empire State Building shining in blue and gold, the state's colors. Earlier Tuesday, Governor Cuomo announced 70% of adults in the state have now received at least their first dose of the vaccine. The governor declaring New Yorkers can, quote, return to life as we know it. What New York has done is extraordinary. We went literally from worst to first. In Washington, plans are now underway for a 4th of July celebration. The National Park Service says the fireworks show will return to the National Mall. And on the 4th, the White House says President Biden will host first responders and service members on the South Lawn, where more than 1,000 guests are expected. Getting back to normal is so important to all of us, mentally, physically, and it's... What a joyous day. The celebrations come even as health officials warn about a new variant of the coronavirus spreading in the U.S. The CDC now officially declaring the Delta variant, first seen in India, a variant of concern. It's more contagious, but the vaccines do appear to be effective against it. Still, doctors say it's important to monitor how the variant spreads among children under 12 who are not yet eligible for the vaccine. It's likely going to be the dominant variant in just a few short months. Parents and their children should continue to follow the CDC guidelines and their own local public health department guidelines. The Delta variant has spread to 34 states, accounting for about 10% of COVID cases here in the U.S. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.